up everybody, D.I.B. Sports on the road, me and my dog Cookie in the background, just read an article about Dallas Cowboys defensive end, Randy Gregory, um, he failed his seventh drug test, man, listen, I'm not a big, I don't want to get too political, I don't think we should be illegal, I think it's kind of silly, uh, it has more pros and cons, so that's my thoughts about marijuana, it helps people with cancer, people with uh, chronic disease and all that. So, I'm not a big fan of the ban of uh, marijuana. However, if a 500K company told me, hey, Dave Brown, I want you to make millions of dollars. However, um, stop drinking beer or something I love to do, play video games. I love NBA 2K, you just can't play 2K anymore. <laughs> bye bye 2K. <laughs> I'm not playing 2K anymore, I'm playing NHL uh, 2K7 or whatever, 2K17, whatever. I, the whole thing is, you gotta sacrifice things in order to be great. And Randy Gregory, his priorities aren't straight. And anyone, you know, being in college, a lot of people, potheads always told me, oh, marijuana is not addictive. Yes, it is. It's addictive. Stop it. That's a joke. Because this guy is willing to sacrifice millions and millions and millions of dollars to do a habit that affects his bottom line, his income, which is ridiculous. Ridiculous. So, I hope he gets help. I'm not trying to judge this guy, but I, that's a serious problem. A seventh failed drug test. Now, it makes more sense why Dallas Cowboys uh, drafted Taco, which I think is a funny name. I got a brother named Chalupa and a sister named Gordita. But anyway, Randy Gregory needs some serious help. And um, I hope he does, but I think he's going to get cut by the Dallas Cowboys. And he's probably going to bounce. Uh, hopefully, he gets his act together and he gets a second chance in the NFL. I don't think it's the most heinous crime, but when you have addiction like that and it affects your bottom line, it affects your income, it affects your life, you have a problem, dude. And you got to change it. I pray for that guy, but man, if someone told me, hey, I'm paying millions and millions of dollars, you just can't drink uh, Miller Lite, you know I'm drinking wine now, because I'm not going to be doing that anymore, because hey, this is a rare opportunity, look up the stats, 0.03% make the NFL, and there's 10 million high schoolers, only 60,000 gets the D1, and barely any of them get scouted for the NFL, and then once they get drafted, half of them don't even make the team. So he's, he's, he's messing up his blessing and, uh, man, I hope he get his act together, man. Him and uh, Josh Gordon, man, they got some issues, but that's my take on that, man. Get your act together. Lay off the weed. 